Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new. If you are new here, hello, I'm Becca. It's lovely to meet you. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and on that note, thank you so much for 1,000 subscribers. I honestly can't thank you enough. I'm so forever grateful. My channel has grown so much this year. At the start of the year, I was at 400 subscribers and I think that was until like July and from then I've just... I've gained 500 subscribers, so that is crazy. Thank you so much. Today, there was something else I wanted to say, and that was Happy Christmas, everyone. Happy Christmas. It is November, currently November the 2nd, and that means it's Christmas. Happy Christmas. This is why I'm wearing this. I will be living in this for the next month until Christmas is over. Anyways, today I'm going to react to ed sheeran's new album it has been out since friday and it is currently tuesday is it tuesday today i think it's tuesday the album is called equals if i'm completely honest i'm not really an ed sheeran fan i'm sorry like i personally think he's a little bit overrated i don't really have anything against him necessarily i just think his music's a little bit overrated and I mean, I like his old stuff, like Thinking Out Loud, The Eighteen, but you know, like up to probably Thinking Out Loud, that sort of era. I like that sort of Ed Sheeran, but now I just think, I'm just not very keen. I'm not very keen on his music. I was quite a fan of like Bad Habits when it first came out, but now it's been overplayed and I'm not happy about that. So the songs on this album that I've already heard are shivers and bad habits i think visiting hours has also been released but i haven't heard that yet so i'll listen to that in this um video and we'll see what i think i'm actually quite looking forward to listening to this though yeah, let's let's go the first song is called tides I feel like this sounds like Ed Sheeran. I felt like I'm gonna have to keep this on. It's keeping my head warm. I feel like Bad Habits really doesn't sound like Ed Sheeran, but this song sounds like Ed Sheeran and I'm living for the lyrics. It's like he's come back and this is him. I love that. I love that. I love this. I love this. I'm in with this Ed. I, I, I stan this Ed. I stan. I stan. That's so cool. In my arms, it always will. This change I love how much this song changes, especially like the, the pace of the song goes through with the lyrics. So like when it says time stops to still the song slows down i am living for this ed i'm living for this Round of applause for Tides by Ed Sheeran. Yes, I am into this. I love the way it starts the album. I I love this. I love this song. I am here for it. Thank you, Ed. Thank you. Woo. Okay. No, I'm genuinely obsessed with that song. Like genuinely. It's such it's such a good way to start the album. And I'm actually so excited to listen to the next song and the other songs. Next song is called First Times. Oh no, is this gonna be a sad one? Playing Wembley. 80,000. This is the dream. But 
out the room, grabbed a couple of you, then we start talking, but we ain't it funny how I, oh but I... Do you hear his voice breaking there? The, the emotion is just so raw. This song is so sweet, I love it. Also kind of want to cry. First night, the first drink, red wine, a step in Oh my goodness, Ed Sheeran. The greatest thing she down one knee. So darling, joking. This is so sweet, I love it. Ain't it funny how life can make a pass us by? Oh, the first kiss, the first night, we're home that night. I can't wait to make a little. Ain't it a little more spy? First, first song that made you cry more first times. Hallelujah, Ed Sheeran. Oh my goodness. I feel like the best songs are the ones that weren't released as singles. Like, why does Ed Sheeran do that? I feel like he probably does that because he doesn't want the best ones to get overplayed, which is actually quite a clever idea. Oh my goodness, I'm not even an Ed Sheeran fan. Maybe I am now. Maybe I am an Ed Sheeran fan. I feel like I was going to say something else and I don't know what it was. Let's just go to the next song, which is Overpass Graffiti. I love how different each song is. Each song gives you a different vibe and a different side to Ed Sheeran. Like there's some like really sort of personal ones, like emotional ones. And then there's some really like dancey ones with loads of i don't know what i'm trying to say what am i trying to say i just love how different they all are this song is insane Makes me want to go to see Ed Sheeran. Okay. I'm in love. I am in love. We still have nine songs. Nine songs left. The next one is called The Joker and the Queen. Oh my goodness. I showed you my hand. This is so sweet. And a gentle touch right into forever and a thousand kings to give you a diamond. Hallelujah. I don't even know what to say. That song makes me want to fall in love. Honestly, 
I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. I feel like we need just a moment of silence for how beautiful that is. Thank you, Ed. Thank you. Okay. We're going to move on to the next song. It's called Leave Your Life. If I forget to say goodbye, hey, would you not feel when I'm away? We'll see the same sky tonight. You'll never know the way every time I leave your bay. I love that. I love how it like starts the way that it ends. Like the same lyrics start the song than end the song. Love that. Love that. Love that. I honestly think I might be an Ed Sheeran fan. And I don't know why I'm like trying not to admit that. Because Ed Sheeran is just wow. Yeah. Ed Sheeran, what a man, what a man. I honestly understand the hype around Ed Sheeran. I feel like the only thing I could say is like, he releases the worst songs as singles. Like there are so many other songs that deserve to be singles. I feel like Tide should have been a single. Anyways. <sighs> the next song is called Collide. I don't even know if I'm ready to listen to any more of the song. I love how it goes aeroplane, aeroplane. I don't know why that makes me laugh. That is so sweet. Oh my goodness. They, these songs make me want to fall in love so I can like make the memories that he's talking about and have someone who, who doesn't mind me losing a wedding ring. Um. Anyways, the next song. The next song is called Two Step. Had a bad week. Spend the evening pretending it wasn't that deep. Taking over. Help me get it off my chest and out Into the ether with the rest of this mess That just keeps us depressed We forget that we're here right Raise, keep the pressure on your pounds It breaks Push it just to dance all our friends And the king Do a picture behind the screen And forget to be Lose the conversation for the message that on me I wish it head out to the place where the music plays Two stepping with a woman I love All my troubles coming up And when I'm in your fight We'll keep turning up And we'll get dips and falls in our time I just 
less than she needs So we press play and step to the beat Gonna cause some praise, keep the pressure on your bound to break Something's called canceling all our plans And I give a damn, head out to the place where it plays And I'm sorry, Ed Sheeran did that, Ed Sheeran can sing, he can rap, he plays guitar, he literally does everything, everything. What a legend, oh my goodness, I'm actually obsessed with this, I'm obsessed. <gasps> we need a minute just to get over that. I don't think I'm going to get over that for a while actually. So should we just move on to the next song? It's called Stop the Rain. Another human cloud to bring you down when you blew the light. Tongue of plastic crowd, too much for me. Is enough. Holding an umbrella when the great clouds come over again. Trying to stop the game they play. But there isn't your mind and you got it. Yeah, yeah. Mind Whoa. Whoa, what's happened to his vocals? I don't have words. I don't have words. Ed Sheeran, what a legend. Next song, Love in Slow Motion. Well, I don't know where it stopped filming, but it did just stop filming. I just reacted to visiting hours and I was in tears. So uh, I'm actually quite glad it stopped filming at that point. And you didn't see my reaction to that song because honestly, I'm a mess. I was a mess. Um, okay, so the next song I'm going to react to is Sandman. Here we go. Daddy made your bed and your lullaby. Mama made the mobile in the sky Fall into the world of your song Whatever you feel Come along for the ride And then a shake of the lamb's tail will go Oh my god, this is so sweet Hanging out with the Sandman Not you now So go to sleep, my love man I love this, it's so sweet, it's so like happy as well. love that i love that on to the last song it's called be right now let's go
Okay, well that was Equals, the album by Ed Sheeran. I am honestly so annoyed that it wasn't filming for my reaction to visiting hours, but I'm also kind of glad at the same time because I was a mess. That song had me in tears. It had me broke. Honestly, that song like grabbed my heart out my chest. It broke my heart. It broke my heart, that song. But it's probably one of the best songs on this album. Pro I probably can't pick a favourite. But I feel like Visiting Hours, um, Tides and The Joker and the Queen and probably Two Step are my favourites. This album is a masterpiece and I'm definitely an Ed Sheeran fan now. Like definitely. I love his music. He's a legend. There is literally nothing he can't do. Wow. Wow. Each song is so different. Like, each song gives a different vibe. It gives a different emotion. Ed Sheeran tells a different story through each song. Honestly, I think I'm honestly still a bit of a mess after visiting hours. Like, I don't think I'm ever gonna... I don't think I'm ever gonna even, even be able to listen to that song. It's like, um, Supermarket Flowers. I can't physically listen to that song because... I will sob my heart out. That is the end of the video. Just wanted to say again, thank you so, 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 so much for a thousand subscribers. I am so, so thankful. It literally means the world to me. And it is nearly, it has nearly been two years since I uploaded my first YouTube video. And... Honestly, starting a YouTube channel was the best decision I ever made. If you are watching this video and you also want to start a YouTube channel, but haven't yet, then this is your sign to do it, honestly. You won't regret it. You have nothing to lose and it will be the best decision that you'll ever make because in the end, we only regret the things that we don't do. Anyways... Thank you so much for watching. We will be getting some more reaction videos because there's a Taylor album that's been released this month and a Little Mix album that is being released this month. And I'm sure there's going to be a lot more music that's going to be released. So yeah, um, with all that said, I'm going to go now. Goodbye. This video is a long video, it's gonna take ages to edit, so bye! I know, I know you are.